When we were watching TV last summer and saw people in line for food, you know, if you can't afford food, how are you affording clothing? An unaddressed need. When the number of families in need of food assistance skyrockets, what other needs get pushed aside? That question prompted one organization to build a better land by expanding their efforts to make sure kids in crisis are dressed for success. They meet several times a week. We create personally shopped and gender and size specific clothing bags. Packing up clothes, personal hygiene items, and school supplies for kids in need. We pack dignity into them. It's called Share What You Wear, and it wasn't always this way. When the program started in 2008, it was an annual back to school event. But we noticed a couple of years ago that there was sort of a change in community need. Looking to fill that need, the National Council of Jewish Women here in Cleveland was ready to expand. They worked to set up a community closet at Bedford High School. Then the pandemic shut down schools, so they built their own community closet in the council's Warrensville Heights warehouse. Families are struggling. It's a pandemic. They're, you know, facing economic hardship. Co-chairs Heather Schlang and Nikki Resnick keep the program running, and they make sure these kids are getting quality looks. We try to ask, like, do they have a favorite color? Is there something that they really love? Just so if there's some way that we can meet that need, we try. Because the classroom isn't the only place kids want to dress their best. We've heard that there's a lot of children who do not have what they need to be able to attend school, even virtual school. We've heard, you know, kids don't have the proper clothing to get on camera. Each bag comes with three outfits, pajamas, and seasonal items ranging from winter coats to swimsuits. These volunteers even have their own washer and dryer to make sure everything is top notch. Anything not up to par gets recycled because at the end of the day, we want kids to be excited when they open this bag. Such a great project, and volunteers have delivered hundreds of these bags so far. They say the best way to donate is through your local school or social work agency. Now, we have details on how you can help on the News 5 app.